Well, I got to put in a microphone. Hello, guys. How you doing? How are you? <sighs> Waiting for the weather to get warmer before I go out for my breakfast. <laughs> How are you? I just want to make a public thank you to uh, Mark who is a content creator, photographer, blogger, um, wow, mm. Mm. I feel so much better that I got that off my chest, mm. let me close this window, it's cold now, oh God, Jesus, Sandra Prothman Zabetti. What was that? Oh, my headphones. Oh. Mm-hmm. Mm. How are you? I want to go out and get breakfast, but um, or lunch. I'm going to buy my own frying pan. Hmm. Heat's coming on. Good. Mm-mm-mm. Yeah, I emailed Mark from Soft White Underbelly and, and thanked him. And told him about my breakthrough. So... You know, sometimes listen to other people's stories help you get clear on your story. I'm doing okay. And my hair, it came out great. I love being able to do my own hair. This girl cut my hair to perfection. To perfection. Yeah, so... My my old caseworker um, says she's going to invite me over for dinner. <laughs> mm-hmm. She lives in Jersey. Yeah, this is the mahogany, but I'm going back to the burgundy. The mahogany is brown-based, but the burgundy is red-based. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, boy. Mm. I'm hungry. Nothing, just waiting on this money. Ain't nothing going. No stimulus yet. Thank God I got OnlyFans. I'll get that drop on Monday, so. Oh. Mm. So I want to thank the people who paypal I still got to put you on the wheel. I'm fucking around. Maybe I'll do the wheel today. I'll feel better. Yeah. We're going to do the wheel today. All the people who cash out me the last two months are going on the wheel. And I got some gifts to give away. Mm-hmm. Mm. What's on your agenda today? Hmm. I still haven't got it. It's fucking ridiculous. I know it's coming, but... Like I said, if I didn't have only fans, I'd be hysterical right now that I haven't gotten it. But Monday, I, the drop goes in from un, only fans, 
they keep saying it's the 19th and they said it's the 22nd. Now I'm hearing the week after that before we get our checks. I'm on Social Security. I always get this thing quickly. Um, the lap, the first one at 1200, I got right before, right before my, two or three days before my check. And that bullshit's going to probably happen this time. I don't know. I'm sick of tripping about it. I really am. <laughs> mm mm-hmm. hungry. I gotta get up and get something to eat. Trying to lose weight too, so. I have my bank set up for text and email. I ain't got nothing, so. This way I don't have to keep looking at my account. It'll come through text or email that I got a deposit. When I get it, I'm going to invest $300 of it into blockchain and watch my money grow. I'm going to let that account grow till I'm ready to buy my mobile home and plop it on some land out in Texas with my daughter. That's what I'm going to use that money for. OnlyFans, too, will go toward, you know, my permanent permanent housing. Oh, you guys can't eat inside? We can eat inside now. Mm-hmm. So when I get paid, I'm going to go. And I'll probably go to Dos Caminos and eat inside. The place is so beautiful. I'll, I'll film it. Um, blockchain is uh, a membership that uh you know what it really is it's an investment group but they can't say that it is so it's a a a membership that invests your money on bitcoin bitcoin rodney and a few other multi-millionaires put this together the company is not public yet and my girlfriend put in 300 she got 900 already and it was two months ago so i'm like okay You can sign up people, you know, but, um, you know, it could be 300 fucked off or it could be 300 invested. So I'm going to invest it. If I had invested last year in Bitcoin, <laughs> I'd be okay. If I had invested um, when my friend was talking about Bitcoin seven years ago on Periscope, I'd be straight right now. Why not? Sandra, stop being ridiculous. Go sit inside and eat and enjoy yourself. Unless you live somewhere warm, then sit outside. But if you live somewhere cold, go sit the fuck down inside and go have some dinner and stop tripping. Fear feeds COVID. You're attracting it to yourself being scared. Stop it. Ta-ta, I can't wait to go shopping for you. Mm-hmm. I have the information about it. I haven't looked at it, but um, Sandra, DM me your email, and I'll forward what they sent to me to you so you can look at it. Full disclosure. You know me. I ain't about no spooky shit. I'll let you know everything I know about it. Right now, I don't know. All I know is what I told you. But she sent me the perspective and how to sign up. And... um. Kofunian's into it, so DM me and I'll email it to you. Because, you know, we've been fucking off money and it ain't helping us. We might as well invest it and watch it grow. If you notice, all the millionaires and billionaires, they never, they don't work. They have businesses and they invest. The job is just over broke. Good morning, Tata. Tata, you got a watch soft white underbelly 
on YouTube. Some of the people we know from Skid Row are on there. And you get a chance to hear their real story. Yeah. Oh, Florida, eat outside. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait to go into one of these little restaurants in New York and just eat. I don't know which one. I want to go to a different one. But, you know, Dos Caminos is one of my favorite ones. Yeah, anybody who wants to know about blockchain, just DM me your email. Or email, you know what? Email me your, just email me. Yvette Vono, my first and last name, seven at Gmail. Just do that, Sandra. Email me, and then I can just forward it right there. Soft, white, underbelly. Kitten was on there from the gateway. I know her. When I saw she got housed, I was jealous. <laughs> And she lost her housing. Half the people in the gateway lose their housing. That place is toxic. I wouldn't live there now. They gave me an apartment rent free. I wouldn't take it to live in there. Mm. The guy who had his face shot off, they interviewed him. Yeah. Oh. Well, now I know why. Soft white underbelly reveals why I can't keep the housing and why I've been going through what I'm going through. I'm so happy. So I just want in your house, your apartment. Mm. See, I pay my rent first, then I go get my weed. I don't get my weed and pay my bills later. I pay all my bills. Then I get my weed. <laughs> People got to learn that. You pay your... I used to... Let me tell you. I had an apartment about 40 years ago. And I wasn't paying my rent on time. I had got a car and, you know, I was struggling. My landlord said, you have to pay your rent first. So you'd be homeless. Your rent comes first. So I remembered that. And so I always pay my rent first. Mm-hmm. If I have one. Mm. Oh, and she lost her baby. Wow. Rent, phone. Why? Because that's how I get my money. So rent, phone, food. It's going to go up to 50 today, but I got to dress warm. What am I going to wear? What am I going to wear? I don't know. Oh, God. Shit. Yep. It's going to be a nice day. I should go into Manhattan. I should eat and just jump on a train. Maybe go up to Harlem. I don't know. It's not warm in that. It's warm, but it ain't that warm. <laughs> mm. 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 Mm.
Hey, Shay. How you doing, mommy? Mm-mm-mm. I went to see about a new phone, but the computer wasn't working. They want me to turn in a phone, but your phone can't be all cracked up and broken. I don't want to give them $500 to get a phone. That's ridiculous. I might have to do it because this phone is about to die. But I'll do that when I come back from Jamaica. Fuck that. Because I got a camera. Like my daughter said, I need to pull that camera out and set it up. So I can film myself and then dump it into the computer and edit it and everything. This OnlyFans is going to get... I only got 12 subscribers and I'm getting busy. Yeah. So... Mm. So I'm going to talk to my daughters and ask them what they want me to do. They want me to press forward to get an apartment here, which I know they do, so they can come here and hang out. (laughs) Or just buy the trailer and come down there with them. I think it would be better if we're all together, you know, because we got business that we're doing. So that's why I just keep the room here for 50 and move around, you know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I had to put a down payment and then pay the rest off monthly. iPhone's like $1,000. That's why I want a down payment. I might just get the iPhone 12 and just say, fuck it. Because, you know, I'm using it for photography and stuff. No. Melinda, as soon as I got that stimulus, I'm going live. I don't care if it's 1 o'clock in the morning, 2 o'clock in the morning, 8 o'clock at night. I'm going live. And say, I got it. I got it. I ain't got it. <laughs> I got only fans, though. Which is about to save my ass when I get that money drop Monday. Next month, I'm doing a free subscription for about a week. Promo. Free sub, you can subscribe for free. Because every day I put comment up that people who subscribe can see. No, my breaking news is soft white underbelly. I emailed him today and told him my story and thanked him for helping me find my truth of why I try to kill myself with crack cocaine because I could never figure it out. Or why maybe I smoke too much weed. I know I smoke a lot of weed because I'm bored. But I got shit to do. It's all interconnected. (laughs) Mm. So the good news is I found my truth. That's the good news. And I emailed Mark at Soft White Underbelly. Yeah. Almost 67 years old. And found out where the break was. Because I was never touched. No one ever touched me. I didn't get raped the first time until I was 19. So I had the power of choice. I chose who I wanted to, you know, give my virginity to. Of course, I gave it to a cheater. I'm at a concert, an Isaac Hayes concert. I call him up and say, I got tickets for Isaac Hayes. You want to go? No, I'm busy. I can't go. I go to Isaac Hayes concert. I look back and he's up there with another girl. I'll never forget that. Broke my heart. I was like, what the fuck? I'll never forget that moment. I must have been about 18, 19 years old. So my first lover broke my heart. 
He was fucking like 12 other girls besides me. Suppose I got pregnant. I stayed on some birth control. I was one birth control taking system, boy. But I was a young girl. I had given my virginity to him, and I loved him so much. He was light-skinned with green eyes. His name was Keith Banyan. I talked to him recently. He don't have nothing I want. He retired. He got a lot of money. He lives in a big house. He goes to Vegas and fucks off his money. That's his lifestyle. He ain't traveling nowhere or nothing. I was stood up for, oh, God, Jesus. A formal, that's fuck up, Melinda. (laughs) You're all dressed up and pretty and no date. Yeah, no. Mm, mm, mm. I'm going to go to the park today. I wish Tracy lived closer to me. We would go hang out. Oh, no. No, girl. Oh. Did you ever get your chance to talk to him when you guys got older and tell him what a fucking asshole he was? What am I going to wear today? I have so many clothes, I don't know what to wear. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? Um, I was double dating with a friend, and her brother took me. Oh, so her brother stood you up? Fuck. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, fucking asshole. Hmm. I want to go sit down inside of McDonald's, I think. I talked to Bingy. He said he's going to come back when it gets warmer. Oh, the brother went in his place. Oh, how nice. And he had his tux and everything, so that was good. Man. Mm. Oh, boy. Where's my water? I gotta drink some water. Hold on. Hold on, guys. I gotta hydrate. Mm. Mm. Got my Fiji water. Mm. Oh, he was older and dressed in a suit. Oh, what a sweetie. The guy who stood you up, did he go with another girl? He was just scared. Sometimes guys be just as scary as girls. (laughs) He's probably scared to go out. (laughs) I never went to a prom. I dropped out of high school. Never went to, I went to one formal. I hated it. And I went with a guy I didn't like. Oh, God. And he was all short and fat, and I was all tall and beautiful. There was a, a par, uh, well, I actually had a picture from that day for a long time. It was hilarious. I'm going to go to Manhattan and show off my hair. 
Oh, he just thought he was too cool. Fucking asshole. A fucking asshole. So I got to get a soft white underbelly t-shirt from Mark. <laughs> Probably a drug addict. Dentist appointment is not to June 24th. <laughs> So when I go to Jamaica, I'm going to go see my dentist and see if he'll just take out these 10 teeth for me. Just take them out. So then when I come back here to the States, when I go to the dentist, I'm coming back on the 23rd, the 24th. I come to them with gums. They fit dentures. And then I should have them by, you know, July. So I'm going to have them all pulled in Jamaica. June 24th was the first point. Now, I could get a standby, but I don't feel like going through all that. Oh, boy. Thank God for food stamps. <laughs> oh, no, it's okay. My friends in Jamaica said, Queen, we don't care about your teeth. Come on down. I said, okay. He said, we can get you fixed up down here. I said, all right. Good morning, Heather. How are you? So my goal for fans only, start now, is 500 a week. I'm going to try to make 500 a week. If I can do that. That would make a big difference in my life. I know I can make more than that on fans only, but that's my goal. Um, I have the other one, but I don't want to put it in because it'll knock the uh, speaker. Lachelle Vaughn, how are you? Yeah, so I have to... Um, Get some lingerie and stuff for my channel. I did a poll. What color should my nails be, red or purple? They said red. So I'm going to get some shade of red. I usually don't wear red, but just for them, I'm going to get red. <laughs> I saw a queen in the train station with her hair cut like mine, but it was gray. And uh, she looked like a little mini me, you know, and I was hailing her up. She was on her way out of town. Oh, with the black henna? And you'll love it. Why don't you just get an implant? That's 700. That's ridiculous. Go to a dental school and get an implant. Just implant that one tooth. Boom. You know what I mean? They're ridiculous. And then to put the bridge in, they got to destroy the other teeth to put the bridge in. That's fucking ridiculous. I hate dentists. I really do. They're the biggest pimps. Oh, that's the color? Russian roulette? Oh, okay. Let me write it down. Um... Russian roulette. Hmm, I need to write that down. Hold on. Uh, Russian roulette by Essie. That's a gel, too. Essie's a gel, right? Essie. I'll just buy it and take it to the. 
nail shop. <laughs> what am I going to wear? <laughs> Hold on, guys. I'll be right back. Oh, I know what I'll do. I'll go down. As he makes gels, right? Yeah. I'm going to look for it online today. Put it in my cart. Mm. 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 Oh, God. Oh, I haven't worn this in a while. I love this one. I love this sweatshirt. It's a Pulp Fiction t-shirt. <laughs> Is that bad or what? Pulp Fiction. Got it at TJ Maxx. Oh. Is this a skirt? That's what I wanted. I forgot I had a skirt. <laughs> I forgot I had a skirt. That's what I wanted to wear. I want to take this to Jamaica. Oh, I got some cute pants for Jamaica yesterday. It cost me $4. Let me show them to you. Aren't these cute? Color is purple. Paid $4.99 for them. Widows to the beach, you know. All right, I'm going to get dressed and get out of here. I got to eat something. I'll see you later. <laughs>